with another haul video. So I've been at my honey hole. I've been doing my normal loops, which would be Watertown um, and Oconomowoc and Fort Atkinson. So um, these things I found primarily at, um, I think I found most of these at my honey hole, to be honest with you. Um, yeah. And then maybe um, the Jefferson St. Vinnie's. So I've been going there quite a bit too. So let me show you what I picked up. Um, like, remember I said the thrift is getting kind of slim, but it's okay. I am digging in, finding some things. I'm really, really loving the vintage clothing right now. So I don't know if you've been to my booth or my space at Five Star Antiques and Vintage in Port Atkinson, but I have a little... Um, vintage clothing corner that has been doing pretty well so um i'll show you what i picked up and remember if there's anything you are interested in just email me at happy vintage shopper at gmail and we will chat but i'll show you what i picked up um so that i can get these babies priced and over at five star so here we go here we go okay so most of these things i like i said i picked up at my honey hole and i i put it all together in a pile so I didn't separate it and I don't really know how much I pay for things I don't think but um so I picked up three pairs of these uh, leg warmers um they were $1.50 each at um at twice as nice and I wear these a lot in the winter when I wear my leggings I put these on and then I put my boots on keeps my legs warm I love those um, I picked up this, I believe I got this at the St. Finney's in Jefferson. So this is a cloisonne, Chinese cloisonne box. It is, it's brass. So cloisonne, you can see um, it has like the, the coil in there and then they put the enamel over top of that. I mean, it is in great condition. It's beautiful, beautiful. Um, florals kind of all the way around. So I picked this up, I believe I paid $5 for this, but um, I looked these up on eBay and I think I can probably get, which I don't know if I'm gonna put this on eBay or in my space, probably like 20, yeah. So I got that. I always pick these up when I see them. Does anybody else have a memory of having this on their dresser? Um, so this is a butterfly, I've had owls, I've had smiley faces, I've had different ones over the last year, but paid a dollar for this and I can probably get 10 for this um, on eBay. And then I grabbed these two little cuties. So these are little cupids. I'm kind of loving the cupids. Um, they're, uh, this is like a felty and a gold frame. Here's the back. So I'm thinking for the pair of these, I can probably get maybe $6. I paid 50 cents a piece for these. So and it, I can look them up. It says on the back what they are, but I might keep these for my bathroom. I don't know yet. I might, I might, I might not. I don't know. And then I grabbed this little guy. So this, obviously Halloween is coming up. So this is a black cat, black cat. Um, and this is kind of a primitive, I guess you would say. I think I paid $4 for this. And it's a, I don't know if it's wood or what it is. I'm not sure what the what the material is. I think it might be like a, I don't know. It's different. Maybe a wood or wood pressed wood. I'm not sure. But it's a primitive cat. It's kind of fun. So I got that. And then here's another cloisonne piece. I just love the cloisonne. Um, you can see how intricate the coils are. So this is the same blue. So this is obviously Chinese. So I'm going to get that priced. I love this little base. And then I got this little teapot. Look, look how cute this is. This is cloisonne as well. Brass. Love it. Absolutely love it. There's no damage on this at all. So sweet. So sweet. Okay. So those are kind of like the hard goods that I got. And then I picked up... Um, just a few t-shirts. I've been doing really well with vintage t-shirts. Um, so this is obviously a Halloween um, t-shirt. So I got that. Love that one. And then this is a, a fun 
kind of Halloween one as well. So these are all put at five star. This one's got a graphic on it that says Big Top Brawl. <laughs> Just thought it was fun. And this one says, if only, it's only funny till someone gets hurt, so then it's hilarious. <laughs> T-shirt. And this is Bon Jovi. Now this is not vintage, but I picked it up just because, I mean, it's Bon Jovi. Hello, I need my 80s folks. I mean, it's Bon Jovi. So I grabbed that and this was funny. I really want to keep this, but I don't think it will fit me. If any of you are from the 80s, you will remember MTV when it first came out in the videos. Oh my gosh, so good. I don't know if MTV is still around. Does anybody know? Um, I, don't, I have no idea. This I grabbed for myself. It's a sweatshirt that says love life. So that one I will not be pricing, but I will be, I will be using that. Um, and then I grabbed, these are cool. So these are wool bibs. So they're a hunter green color. So I don't know if they're for hunting Maybe they're like vintage hunting bibs, but I looked these up on eBay and I think I paid $3.50 for them. $3.50. I think I can um, get like $60 for these on eBay. Um, but I really, really thought these were cool. So these are vintage. Um, a wool bib. So pretty cool. And then for my own self, I grabbed... My own self, I grabbed, this is a duvet cover. So I need a duvet, duvet cover for my one bedroom. And this is a shower curtain for my bathroom. So that is it. And I just wanted to, first of all, thank you guys all for watching. And to remind you that if there's anything you are specifically looking for, um, because I do thrift a lot, I am in stores almost every day. I, to be honest with you, I haven't not gone in a store every day, weekday that is, um, in a long time. So if you are looking for something specific, just let me know. Email me at happyvintageshopper at gmail and um, I can take keep a lookout for it and then I can, you know, you know, send you a picture or whatever and um, see if it, you're interested in it. Um, so yeah, I am having an event in our driveway this weekend. So it will be um, four vendors. Um, it'll be Lucky Penny Coffee, obviously. And then myself, I'm going to have some really cool um, vintage collectibles, some bigger items that don't fit in my space at Five Star. I have bleached a ton of flannels that are really, really fun and cool. I have some vintage clothing. So, um, and then we're going to have Camp Her, so they have the infused um, cocktails. And then Five Star Antiques and Vintage will be there. Kate will be there. And then um, Broadway Bakers will be coming. So they have the amazing cookies that you've all seen at the Fort Farmers Market. So hope you can make it 9 to noon this Sunday, September... 11th September 11th 9 to noon 115 East Greenwood Street thank you guys so much for watching sorry it's a short one but you know that's what I've been finding so you guys have a great day and look for my next video don't forget to like comment and subscribe it's free and I'll see you next time and don't forget happy shopping everyone bye